Hey everybody, it's Wolvash. Welcome back to Wolfenstein. All right, I said we would read this and then we would pick up our uh, our, our, our wheelchair-bound friend. Um, Gibraltar Bridge opened Madrid, October 3rd, 1957. The biggest bridge ever built was finally inaugurated yesterday evening in front of a gathered crowd of top Nazi politicians as well as specially invited upstanding citizens in the area. The honor of cutting the ribbon went, of course, to our beloved leader who was flown in from Berlin this morning and held a short but powerful speech afterwards in front of the impressive construction crossing the Gibraltar Strait. I was moved to tears, said Wilma, a local shop owner. He has such a way with words. She wasn't the only one moved to tears. Gunther Grunwald, head engineer of the project, received a special thanks from our leader. I am speechless, said Grunwald afterwards. I don't know what to say. All right, all right, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. I'm coming. Yeah, I can... I can use this now. I don't have to climb out. Although, if I did climb out, what would I find? Okay, we need to pick stuff up, charge stuff up. Everything we can do, we gotta do. Man, I'm glad that thing wasn't shooting at me. Perfect. All right, where's Caroline? Said put her in the last helicopter. Was she attached to one of these things? Yes, she was. You attached a person who can't move their legs to a paraglider and threw her in? That seems reckless. Nope, doggone it. Okay, fine, whatever. Yeah, it's kind of mean. I've been making her lay there. Here we go. Man, I didn't know you'd be doing frontline work. That seems a little reckless. You're going to be the pilot, huh? Okay. That's good for you. I don't want to be the pilot. Choo choo! How did you survive? I thought you were dead. Don't remember much. Remember punching Hans Gross in the face. Remember ascending into the sky. For a moment there, I thought it was going to heaven. Then falling, then pain. First pain of my life. Felt like my insides were running out through my back. Could barely move. Had to crawl. So they found me after three days in a ditch. Long months in a crisis hour. Hospital beds, they were shoving tubes in me. Infection. Ugh, these things I don't want to remember. I'm sorry about your legs. Don't be. I've learned how to fly. That was suitably iconic. What the what? Now we're going to fight, Caroline. Yes, they will. Trust me. Wow, that's like that ain't low-level flying skills. You guys all are that good? Hey, well, never. Don't worry. You just have, have you to be finished complaining? the best pilot in the world. Every time. <laughs> <laughs> what is the dot you should? How can we get in contact with them? Anya, what do we know? Very little, but I have some ideas. Good. Anya, you take the lead on this. Blaskovic, whatever she needs, you help her find it, yeah? All right, what do you need? William, I could use your help. Could you come over here for a second? I'm here. What do you need? I found some interesting leads. This parchment describes um, a way to create a type of super concrete. This is what the Nazis have used to build all these concrete monstrosities around here. Yes, everything, even this place. This is the only concrete they used. This is how they created all those, those cities so quickly. Now that we know where it comes from, I need a sample of it for a closer study. Can you look around here for a piece of exposed concrete that shows an outbreak of mold? It 
should be porous enough for you to cut me a sample. Whatever you need. Also, there was this encrypted list of Dad Yishut members in Poland during the war. I need to compare it with the official German state records on Jewish citizens in the years between 1939 and 1945. Can you see if those records are in the archives room? I'll get right on that. And there's uh, one more thing. Um, it's quite critical. What? Ooh, critical smooches. That'll be all. We can go now. <laughs> You've served your purpose, big man. Now get to work. Nope, she is done. She got her smooch. She is done with me. What is this? Oh, the map. Uh, we've read all this stuff. See, we did it once. We don't got to do it twice. Um, but we do need to find a moldy wall. And a key, apparently. You need keys. <laughs> Idiot. Well, they give me keys. I thought I get rid of there earlier. I did. He had keys. Okay. Mold spores coming from the vent. Where is the intake? Um. Oh. Could be down here. This is a lot of wet concrete. Seems like there could be something something of note in here. Nobody knows about this place? This is your secret hideout? This seems like incredibly huge. Okay. You guys don't mind me. I'm just going to start sawing at the base. Is this mold dangerous for people? Because it's kind of like a lot of mold. Like Last of Us levels of mold spores. Has anybody seen a saw for me? Here it is laying on the ground. Whoa, that kind of saw? Whoa! Way to go, genius. Well, yeah, cool. You couldn't toss me a rope or anything, huh? Just make me walk through the sewer. That's fine. That's fine. I see what kind of valued member I am on this team. I'm just here for smooches and pee walking. Okay, I, well, you know. I didn't know. Why would there be a laser gun in the sewer? They guarding the poop? <laughs> it's top secret poop. Alright. Yeah, 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 yeah. I see you coming this time. Just gotta get a little bit around the corner here. There we go. You know, I don't, I'm not digging the laser gun. I, I understand that it has power, but there's no oomph to it. There's no impact. It doesn't feel like you're hitting anything when you hit things. Alright. Well. Charged me up. Didn't use a lot, so it shouldn't take long. Charge me up. Charge me up and don't stop. Yep, I might need armor to protect me from the... turrets we have in here. Oh, a House of the Rising Sun record? Yeah, I want to hear that. It's a polka version? <laughs> 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 
Newman Recordings isn't just for those zany kids. Our family of artists also includes Germania's greatest performers of our people's music, the kind of music Opa and Oma would like. The jewel of our crown is Wilbert Eckhart and his Volksmusik All-Stars. From polka and waltzes to Borischer and marches, they represent the fatherland at its finest, beer, brats, and the German way of life. From the classics you grew up with to today's pop hits interpreted into pure German tradition, Wilbert Elcott and his Volk Music All-Stars have something for everyone. That's freaking hilarious, man. That we've got the Beatles and, uh... Ah, uh, who does House of the Rising Sun? Why is my brain fritzing on it? Fritzing, no pun intended. I saw you before. What are you? Oh, you're the upgrade. Reflection? Wait, how does that work? The laser works been updated with a reflection module. This alters the beam course to bounce almost, almost off any surface in a new direction with a slightly weakened effect. Okay. Let's see how it works. Not weakened enough, I guess. We'll keep it all... Uh-oh. Come on. Holy Moses, okay. How many are there? Are we done with this noise now, please? Holy jeez almighty. Okay. Okay. Oh good, more. Okay, super duper 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 duper. Can we stop that now, please? Also, if anybody knows why I'm randomly pulling my knife out and swinging at things that are nowhere near me, I'd love to know the answer to that. Alright, don't tell me I gotta swim through this to get back, because I ain't up for it. There was a door here. Yes, I'll take it. Opens from the other side. Of course it does. Okay, up is always a good way to get out of here, right? Like 100% of the time you go up if you're in the sewers. I didn't know just getting a circular saw was going to turn into such a magical adventure. Full of flying turrets and poor shotguns and rivers of fetid water. Hey, we're back. All right, let's get to work. What the damn hell are you doing? Science project. Well, you're scaring Max. We'll tell Max to chill out. Sorry, pal. Didn't know we'd flip out like that. That his son? No. Well, kind of. I don't know. Kind so of. Not his son. Used to be Klaus had a son, born during the war. A miracle, he called it. They had tried for years to have a child, him and his wife. Yeah, well, he'd make a pretty good father for a Nazi. The child was born with a club foot. 
Krauss knew, of course, what that meant. He begged the doctors not to report it to the authorities. Then secret police showed up to take the boy away. Klaus and his wife tried to stop them. The wife died from a bullet to the head. The child, too. Klaus could not protect them. So he blames himself? I think so. And he will never forgive the Nazis. All right. Maybe check on Max. See if he's okay. What is this? Lost toy. Well, I found you. Of course you did. I'm guessing we're gonna give it to Max. Apparently, we need a truck, a telephone, a block. Like, am I got what? I don't know what's going on here. <laughs> Hello. What's in here? Canned foods? No toys? Um, I got your thing, but maybe I should look around more. Oh, what's this? Bobby's letter. Charlotte, do you remember the red cat? How it begged by our window and how you fed it shrimps? Or the snail on the porch who fell down the table onto your knee? Do you remember the sunny side of Primrose Hill, the broken glass of Clapham Pride in the nursery school, the one you said our politicians killed? Do you remember how your smile turned into tears, how you flew and flew into my arms and laughed and kissed music into my ears? Do you remember how your anger turned into fear and how you listened and listened and talks and talks and how all the promises disappeared? Do you remember the red cat, how it craved and how it came back every day? I think it belonged to Miss Calloway, I'm not sure, but it would explain why it didn't when she moved away. Why it didn't? Um, do you remember Moni's smile? How she laughed and laughed at this clownish snail? How she ran down the slopes of Primrose Hill and saw her and her first taste of beer and her eyes when blood appear? Or outside the playground, tears and tears and hugs and all the hugs and how she danced in the air and how I love you, dear. How I love you, dear. I don't know. I'm not a poetry guy. Like, to me, good poetry is boring and bad poetry is awful, so I'm just, that's just not me. Okay. Well, whatever we're looking for, we're not going to find it in there. Still don't have a key. Don't laugh at me. You need keys. Shut up. Call me idiot. Alright, something's going on here. Fetter Bolton. Fergus, I need the keys to the archives. You got them? Yeah. Hang on. Fuck! 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 You okay, Fergus? His desk is stuck. Stuck, stuck, stuck. We stuck, stuck, stuck. keep doing that. We'll be alright. We can still get the job done. Aye? For how much longer? What's this about, Fergus? I don't know. Nothing. Everything. It's about that boy, goddammit. Private Wyatt. He should be here instead of me. He was young. He, he had potential. He could have given us a future. You and me were two fucking mummies from the past, running on nothing but willpower. I made the wrong choice. Oh, well, that's fucking obvious, isn't it? I was ready to die. I would have done it gladly. I worked my ass off to save that boy, Blazkowicz, and you fucking pissed it away on a whim. Remember Prendergast? That fucking kid, he could endure anything. Now he's gone. They're all fucking gone. And you're stuck with this useless fucking skeleton. I mean, tell me, what's the long-term solution, eh? Who's gonna take over when we're too damn battered to strap on the holsters anymore? I'll get the fuck out. I need a nap. You do need a nap. You're cranky. All right. Dumb American oaf. Who called me that? Hey. You're not as good as whispering as you think you are. All right. 
Alright. Where would this guy's toys be? I can sleep. Oh, if I can sleep, can I get a health upgrade? I got one last time, so I mean... <gasps> yeah! Sweet! Alright, find the lost toys. Uh, oh, we put the robot back. We checked it off. Okay. I will do my best. Are they like literally everywhere or can I f find them in specific places? You know, I never looked. Can I like... No, not there. Back. Can I like... Oh, look at this. Here's my perks. Tactical. Deadeye. Increases damage from headshots while aiming down a weapon sight. Uh, quick draw, the speed of the weapons are quick and unquick. Oh, it tells me how I have to get them, too. Uh... Headshot kills. Overcharge your health to reach 200. Oh, man, I need to do that then. Holy Moses. Okay. Um, increase the handgun's magazine size using kills from cover. Um, kills from cover using assault rifle. And then assault rifle kills. Just kills. Wait, I've only gotten 10 using the assault rifle? Huh. That doesn't seem right. Um, let's see. Assault increases reloading speed. Kills while sprint sliding. Um, increases ammunition loot. Increases ammunition storage for all turret guns. Endurance. Auto Panzer. Increase the battery size for energy weapons. Dual wield expert. Increase ammunition storage for all standard weapons. Increase the chance of dual wield dismemberment. Okay. Demolition. Ability to throw back grenades. Um, increase the amount of grenades you can carry by one. Increase the amount of grenades you can carry by one. Um, I need to kill a commander with a grenade. Okay. Makes grenades detonate on target. Increase assault rifle rocket ammunition storage. Increase explosive vaporization. Reduces uh, damage take from one's own explosives. Reduces damage take from enemy explosives. And then there's my stealth. Um, stealth killing commanders at interest points to the map. Ah! Unlocks the ability to throw knives at a target. Increases the amount of knives you can carry by one. By one. Increases damage when using a silenced handgun. Unlocks the ability to receive health from performing takedowns. Displays commanders on the map. And it reduces the sound made by... Okay, cool stuff. Uh, predictable tutorials, notes, find the lost toys. Um, okay. Nope. No kind of like tracking. We just gotta like just do it. I mean... Those lost toys could be anywhere. Especially if like gotta look through the whole... Ooh. Yeah. It's not helping the fly situation, though. Ugh. Okay. Ooh, Panzerhund parts. What's this? Ah. Can I practice? Guess not. Okay. Oh, what's this? What's this? Wait, no, no. How do I get my how do I get my my trusty laser gun? Are you tricking me with this now? What? I Okay, it let me have knives and then it took them away and now I'm not sure what's going on. What what the heck is this? Okay. Ah, oh, look, it's classic Wolfenstein. That's fantastic. Nightmare? Oh. Oh, we got to try, right? We got to try. Uh, you know what? I say we try it next time. I'll stop right here just so we can try this next time. 
Um, and then we'll continue our search for toys and files and blah de blah de blah de blah de blah. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this, and uh, I hope you come back for the next one. But until then, uh, take care of yourselves.